another cool application for potential music artists is personalizing a soft guitar case. Once again, we sourced all of our items just from suppliers on Amazon, which typically have good prices on stuff that's not you know, typical blanks that you're going to get from a company like Sanmar or whatnot. Um, in this case, I'll stay with the 16 by 20 platen. I'm just going to do the same sort of thing where I'm going to unzip the guitar case. Try to get it as open as possible so I can load onto the press. Now I'm going to use the same size heat printing pillow I just used for my last application and insert into here. It's not a problem if the zipper hits the pillow. Ultimately the pillow is designed with a low density so the zipper and buttons and things like that can actually fall down into it and you still get an even pressure on your application area. Um, that's not true with the heat printing uh, or a print perfect pad. You need the pillow if you need to absorb an item like a zipper or whatnot. Should be a relatively the same pressure since I just had another item loaded with the pillow. This one's for the same band that we did the table throw for. So that's finished, but we're not done with this yet. That's a good application, but how about doing the handle part of the guitar case? That's going to be our next application. And for that, I'm going to load our sleeve and leg platen, which is one of my favorite platens for this press. It's a new one. It's also $225. And while the, the common application for it is long sleeves or, or long legs, I think it's a full like 6 by 20 or 5 by 20 inch printing area. So you can actually do a full vertical long sleeve. It also works wonderfully uh, for this particular application. So having the right tool for a job is key. I'm going to fold this part underneath so I don't have to mess with it. And then try to... Get the stem of the guitar onto the press. Cover it. And since I took that pillow out of there, I'll probably have to increase my pressure a little bit. And now we are going to drop on the Keeping It Country saying, the same thing we put down on the belt, if you remember. Position that onto the press. And lock it down. It's really easy. I mean, it's just kind of repeating the same thing. Once you figure out how to heat print and how to level out your pressure, it's just a matter of figuring out how to fit your item on the press. When you invest in a heat press, you want a heat press with the versatility to be able to fit a lot of different items. And the Hotronics Fusion is just that. So you can see it just kind of embeds down um, into the actual material and we get a nice result.